Zack Makes His Own Luck by Anna Junker, illustrated by Joe Blake. Zack is a boy, just like any other. He lives with his brothers, caring father and loving mother. But what you do not know is a secret that he keeps. It's something that he would only tell you when he sleeps. Zack has a leprechaun who sits on his shoulder. He is fairly light and not heavy like a boulder. He gives him luck in every little thing, and to Zack's shoulder he firmly clings. Whether it's passing an exam or winning in sports, or even when he creates his giant Lego forts, Mr. Leprechaun whispers his magic as he whisks his hand. The luck he gives to Zack is truly grand. But for the last few days Mr. Leprechaun has been unwell. His magic has stopped working. He's not able to cast a spell. Even though Zack needs it, he can't grant him luck. The poor young boy feels like he's a sitting duck. Just a moment, Zack reflected. I may not need all your luck as I suspected. I may have been a bit too greedy, and I don't think it's reasonable to be this needy. Not to worry, Mr. Leprechaun, now you can rest. I will work hard at everything and try to be my best. So Zack began studying as best he could. Memorising his books, knowing he would do good. He gave his very best on every test, and to his own good luck he aced the rest. He knew that he would succeed, because for once he didn't need Mr. Leprechaun's magic or his good luck, and because of that, Zack perked up. As time passed, Zack did everything. On his own, his hard work would bring his successes and all the things he had hoped, for when he finally did it, he was truly stoked. As Zack became his best, Mr. Leprechaun said, I'm proud of you, so now I'll just go ahead, back to my family because my work is done. You keep doing what you're doing and have lots of fun. And with a bow and a wink of his eye, Mr. Leprechaun disappeared, leaving Zack questioning why. But now he's happy because he finally realised his own luck and efforts are soon to be recognised. If he worked intently at everything he did, giving his best even though he was just a kid, with the belief in himself making the effort that was due, he continued to make his luck as he always wanted to. The End